question 229 4x y square plus 6y dx plus 5x square y plus 8x dy equal to 0 the given differential equation is in the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0 so the first step we should do is check whether the given equation is exact by using the necessary and sufficient condition dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x so dou m by dou y here is uh, 8xy plus 6 and dou n by dou x is 10xy plus 8 as you can see uh, dou m by dou y is not equal to dou n by dou x so for the differential equation is not exact now we have to find an integrating factor to convert this differential equation into an exact equation so we have discussed many rules since we were discussing rule 6 we, we are going to apply rule 6 you can check whether any other rules apply apply in this question anyway i am going to uh, use rule 6 to solve this problem so to apply rule 6 we will have to make some rearrangements um, so if you write 4xy square dx plus 5x square y dy plus 6y dx plus 8x dy equal to 0 you can take xy outside so xy outside we get 4y dx plus 5x dy plus 6y dx plus 8x dy equal to 0 so as you can see now this is in the form x raised to alpha y raised to beta into my dx plus n x dy plus x raised to alpha dash into y raised to beta dash into uh, m dash y dash uh, y dx plus n dash x dy equal to zero so in this question integrating factor uh, can we can say that integrating factor will be of the form x raised to h into y raised to k for such questions if x raised to h into y raised to k is the integrating factor we can multiply throughout and use this property of exact equation which is dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x and find h and k find the values for h and k so i will just i'll do one thing copy this question so this is our equation i will multiply throughout by h and k we will have 4 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k plus 2 plus 6 into x raised to h into y raised to k plus 1 dx plus 5 into x raised to h plus 2 into y raised to k plus 1 plus 8 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k dy equal to 0 so we have this and since uh, we are saying this is an exact equation uh, we have dou m by dou y equal to dou n by dou x so we will first find dou m by dou y so dou m by dou y is 4 into k plus 2 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k plus 1 plus 6 into uh, k plus 1 into x raised to h into y raised to k similarly dou n by dou x is equal to 5 into h plus 2 into x raised to h plus 1 into y raised to k plus 1 plus 8 into h plus 1 into x raised to h into y raised to k so since these two are equal we can compare the coefficients and find values of h and k so that gives 4k plus 8 is equal to 8 sorry 
5 h plus 10 so let's call this one 2 comparing 1 and 2 let this call let's call this okay wait before naming and this is the first equation then second equation is 6k plus 6 is equal to 8h plus 8 so if you this becomes 5h minus 4k plus 2 equal to 0 3 and this becomes so we can just divide throughout by 3 uh, sorry divide by 2 we have this so 4h minus 3k so 4 minus 3 is plus 1 equal to 0 so you can we can so solving 3 and 4 get uh, h by um, minus 4 minus 4 minus minus 6 so plus 6 equal to k by 4 into 8 minus 5 is equal to 1 by 5 into minus 3 so minus 15 minus uh, minus 4 into 4 so plus 16 so that implies h is equal to um, 16 minus 15 is 1 so 6 minus 4 is 2 so 2 by 1 2 k equal to 8 minus 5 which is 3 3 by 1 this is 1 3 by 3 so h equal to 2 and k equal to 3 so our integrating factor is x raised to h into y raised to k so x raised to 2 okay. so therefore integrating factor is x raised to h into y raised to k so x raised to 2 into y raised to 3 so we got our integrating factor as x square y cube now since this is our equation let me just let me just copy this into new page So we have this equation. If you apply values for sorry. So if you apply values for h and k, you will get uh, it uh, get this equation in mdx and dy form. So we got h is equal to 2 and k equal to 3, right? Let me just h equal to 2 and k equal to 3. So if you apply h equal to 2 and k is equal to 3 we get 4 into x raised to 3 h plus 1 is 3 right 2 plus 1 is 3 so y into k plus 2 so y raised to 5 plus 6 into x raised to h so 2 y raised to k plus 1 so 4 dx plus 5 into x raised to h plus 2 so 4 into y raised to k plus 1 which is 4 again plus 8 into x raised to h plus 1 so 3 into y raised to k 3 dy equal to 0 so this is our equation exact equation now for exact equation solution is given by integral m dx where y is a constant plus integral terms in n without x 
py equal to a constant so our m is this and n is this so finding the integral we have integral 4x cube y raised to 5 plus 6x square y raised to 4 dx plus this term terms in n without x every term has n in x in n so second integral vanishes to 0 so this is equal to a constant so integrating with y as a constant we get 4 y raised to 5 into x raised to 4 by 4 plus 6 y raised to 4 into x cube by 3 equal to c simplifying we get x raised to 4 into y raised to 5 plus 2 x cube y raised to 4 is equal to c so this is the final solution to our question we applied rule 6 and found out our integrating factor x which is x square y cube and these are the steps these are th this is the solution to question number 229